And here I'm Red, and this is going to be a uh, news flash or something or other. Anyway, I just wanted to get this out to you before uh, they change their rules or figure out what's going on. But Harbor Freight kind of forgot something in their last set of coupons. As we all know, any of those the massive mega coupons they put out, the 20 percenters and those rare 25 percenters, they always have a huge list of caveats of basically anything you really want, anything that's really cool at Harbor Freight, you, you can't use the coupons for. They, they spell it out by category and also by their own brand names and such. But as we all know, Harbor Freight recently did something. They started adding a whole bunch of new products with a whole bunch of new brand names as they're trying to enter this uh, prosumer market thing they're going after. Well, one of those items they added one of the brand names, I should say, is <laughs> Yukon. <laughs> yeah, he's a cousin of mine. <laughs> he's on my mother's side. We don't talk to him much. Anyway, the, uh, I've been uh, looking at one of them Husky tool or Husky uh, toolboxes for some time. And uh, I had a rolling toolbox. It was some generic one. It was a clone of one of these that I picked up at a garage sale for cheap. And I had that thing for years, but I sold it in the recent move as I was trying to clear stuff out. And I did uh, some searching on the old uh, uh, YouTubes and I ran across a comparison between Husky and Yukon. And I I'm going to link it up here below. You got to watch this video. The guy goes into into great detail and I learned something new. Apparently there's a tool called uh, Riv, what was it Riv Nuts or something? Riv Nuts. Anyway, that's a pretty cool little tool. You'll see if you watch the video. You gotta watch the video. You would have thought, you know, that the as typical Harbor Freight wanted to be, um, you know, a step down or something maybe from the Husky brand. I mean, definitely we're not comparing Snap-on or something here, but turns out that the, the Yukon tool is, you know, a, a step or two above the Husky box. And at, you know, 300 bucks, it's right in the same kind of pricing, if not already a little bit cheaper. So I went down to the store and I said, you know, I'm going to, I need to get one of these things. Well, and, and I use a lot of, I like to have my hand tools all out and stuff. So, uh, I didn't really need the, the nine piece system here. So I went for this, the, 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 the standard one with the, the two doors down there and stuff. You know, I looked at my 20% off coupon, and if you read through it, I mean, oh, by the way, you can now use these coupons. In fact, all their coupons, you can use it right on your smartphone. Right there on the ad, it says, you know, right here in the small print, let's get down here, it says, uh, limit one per customer, blah, 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 blah. And it talks about, you know, no storage, day, parking days, but no savings meals. Storage cabinets, chests, or carts. And then I look down for the brand, and we got Predator, and Tailgater, and Viking, and Vulcan, and Zerk, and that... There's no Yukon in there. So I, I hustled my little fuzzy bare butt down to the store. And, you know, I, I pointed out, I was like, well, here's my coupon. And they, of course, said, well, you can't use it with this because this is a tool chest. I said, no, it's not. It's a mobile workbench. It says it right there. Alexa, stop. There's that dang Alexa again. Anyway, I said, and you got other workbenches here. And that's a specific category. We're using specific nouns. That's a specific category. And you got to honor this because I drove all the way over here and I'm sorry if you got some super secret inner policy that says you, you can't do this. Fact is you advertised it. You sent it to me. You got to honor it. And they looked at it and they went, you know what? You're right. It doesn't say Yukon on there. And they were, they were stunned. And it doesn't, and this says it's a more mobile workbench. And it does not say it's a tool cabinet and it doesn't say it's a cart or anything else. It says it's a workbench. That's the noun it's right there in the title. In fact, if you do a search on their website for uh, tool cabinet or whatever, this doesn't even come up. You do a search for workbench, this does come up, and all those red tools and those tool cabinets and stuff do not. Anyway, you know, there's the old receipt. You kind of know some people will be there like, ah, 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 ah. Nope, and right down there it says, you know, 46 inch two door workstation. As you know, on, on the receipt, it does not say cabinet. Uh, and there's my 20% off uh, item discount. They had to do an override, apparently, or something. Reason for customer satisfaction. I can tell you, I'm, I'm, I'm darn satisfied. Anyway, this is definitely one of those, your mileage may vary because, you know, obviously, if you get somebody in a grumpy mood, they're just going to, you know, you know, slam their foot down and say, no, I ain't going to do it. But the fact of the matter is, yes, yeah, stand up for your rights. They're advertising it. It does not say storage cabinet. 
It does not say tool cabinet. It says it's a workbench. And they've advertised it. They've mailed it out. They got to honor that. And, you know, that's the one thing you got to know. Here's a, a top tip for you. The, the store managers at Harbor Freight have quite a bit of leeway and quite a little power to, to do it as they see fit with their store. And, you know, this is a case where you know, you know full well that next month when those uh, coupons come out, right there in that list of brands, the, there'll be a big Yukon right there. And this ain't going to happen again. So if you want, I say hustle down the stores because this thing is a screaming deal. What I pay? 215 for this thing. Also, guys, when you go down there, be civil. If, if they try to argue with you about it, there's, there, there's no point in cursing and cussing and none of that. You just state, matter of fact, dog. Settle down. She's doing a labra dance or something. I think she's a an Irish setter doing river dance or something. Anyway, as I said, be civil, be nice. You get more bears with honey than you do with well, maybe maybe with some whiskey and some honey and some honey whiskey. Anyway, that's it. Y'all take care. Merry Christmas. Shine on.